Man has been using measurements for thousands of years. But just what are measurements? How much water should we bring for the hunt? Each man will need two rabbit skins full of water. How much water do we need for the hike, sir? Each person should bring at least one litre of water. All measurements have two parts to them. A numerical value followed by a unit of measurement. We make use of measurements in life every day. Take a look at the dashboard of a car. There are so many units of measurement. How did they come about? Man's early units of measurement came from the things around him, parts of his body. However, the measurements varied from object to object and from person to person. He has cheated me. I can't help it if my assistant's cubit is short. To prevent any further confusion, use my cubit and make it the standard cubit. Sticks of the same length as the standard cubit were made and used all over the country to measure length. To create a standard unit of measurement, it must first be defined and accepted by everyone. John's bread did not turn out well because he did not use the standard cup like Janet. Scientists use a common standard of measurement. This standard is called the International System of Units, which is commonly known as the SI units. Some examples of SI units are the second for time and the kilogram for mass. Most countries have a department to ensure that the SI units in the country are consistent with that of the rest of the world. This is very important in our global economy.